center of the course, coming on electric finish. Do it again. He's coming at Rainbow Bridge. He's a board leader and he will do it again. You'll need to get your place accumulator perms or straight lines on by 5 to 1 on Sunday. The 1200 meter maiden plate will set off. Of course, that bet, which is such a lovely bet. Graham and my perms, as we see later on in the show, I've gone very light in the early three legs. I do think number two, Hail Columbia, is going to be tough to beat. On reputation, the word was out there. Took on uh, Captain Fontaine on debut, ran an absolute cracker. And uh, I don't often do this. I don't know what price the horse is, probably odds on. But I think whatever beats Hail Columbia will win. Not just odds on. I was, I myself was surprised. The bookmakers are definitely taking no chances. One to three. Wow. Number two, Hail Columbia, one to three. Okay. There's no doubting uh, that he's obviously the one to beat, but I thought, wow, one to three. Anyway, he ran a great second first time out to, to the very promising Captain Fontaine. Uh, Garth Buller made no secret of the fact that Captain Fontaine is a very promising individual. So it was a very good debut. He is a four-year-old in the race card, a son of uh, Star Spangled Banner, he's Irish bred, so he's actually three and a half, he's six months behind the South African horses. Uh, but yes, he looks the obvious choice and clearly a place accumulator banker and possibly the horse that's going to start all the multiples of the day. So I guess you've got to try and find what the exactors and trifectas are and again it looks pretty obvious. I thought number 10, Rite of yes. Passage, uh, looks the obvious choice to run second, a three-year-old son of Trippy representing the Richard Faree justin Snaith combination and Lord Wiley for third and uh, I've got number 14 uh, follow suit uh, for fourth but the first three look fairly obvious uh, it's either 2107 or 2710 but 2 Hail Columbia looks impossible to oppose. We are both singing firmly from the same hymn sheet because Graham's gone 21714. I've gone 21714. And before we go, let's give you another comment. We had Warren Kennedy on the podcast, Gold Circle podcast, that I suggest you go and look at that on our Facebook page because it was really a long but hellishly interesting podcast with Warren Kennedy, our South African champion jockey. Got it all. He rides horse number five. Nice type but expected to need the run on debut. So that is the comment for the first timer from the Gavin Van Zale stable from Warren Kennedy.